Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Crystal and for today's video, we're going to be showing you how I planted up my front porch pots and I did some decorating. But before we start, I do want to mention I get about three-ish hours of sunlight in this front porch every morning um, and we don't get any more sun for the rest of the day. So that's something to keep in mind for how much sunlight you get, whether you get any rain or dry under the porch, all of that is going to contribute into your selection of plants. I also want to mention that I garden in a zone 8A. I know some people like to know the gardening zones. It's very hot and humid here and in South Carolina, so I can get away with putting a little bit more sun heat loving things during the fall because we have such a mild fall and winter. All right, if you're ready to get started, let's go. So here's the first container. I kept my old uh, pineapple brandy coleus. I thought this would be a really nice lime moment. Also planted some pomegranate punch super bells. We have a very, very mild winter. In fact, it's still extremely hot right now. And so I know that they do pretty well in the fall here. We also have some penny black violas, and then I planted some Colossus fire pansies. I have two here, three of the, no, four of the black violas, 
and then I also put in a dressing mirror here and I ended up putting one back in there and those will fill in really nice. For this container, I have an El Brito Coleus in the back, a Dolce Wild Berry Hookra. I have two Dusty Mellers there and then I went in with the same Pansy, the Colossus Fire, the Penny Black, and then I added some Penny Deep Blue. And then I also added the Lemon, I believe it's Lemon Coral Sedum, just a little bit from a piece that I have not planted and I've had it all summer. And I just put out my fall wreath. I put a an Apple Orchard Fragrance broomstick. I don't know. I think they're really cute. Throw in a little bit of charm and it smells really nice. have my fall mat and my favorite guy, Snoopy, and his pumpkin with what's stuck on top. So here is my little front porch display. Here is our first pot. I feel like it's gotten a lot bigger since I I planted it. The violas have really taken off. I got a cute little scarecrow that I've had for several years. I did go ahead and pick out some pumpkins. Initially I was going to stack them up straight and just cut off the stem of the green one, but I like the little whimsical look that it has curved like that. My mat, my witch's broom, a little fall wreath. There is the planter. A fun looking pup in there. And my mom is doing surprisingly well. The trick with moms is putting them in a container where they have a saucer with water. I need to fill up that saucer for it. It hasn't wilted, it hasn't burned, even with the heat here. And that is it, you guys. Such beautiful color here. So that is it for today's video. I hope it was helpful or inspiring for you to be able to, you know, maybe plan up your pots or do a little bit of decorating. I have a very small front porch, so whether you do this on a small scale or a bigger scale, I hope it was helpful in some way. All right, till next time.